Nazarene said he'd rise again after three days. We will lose peace and order if it's true. Will the people believe it? The weak will. There will be no other gods. My name is Steve Merkovich. I am the lead picture editor on this film, Risen. As editors, we all bring something a little bit different. If there's 10 people in a room and they're given the same film, you'll get 10 different versions of that film because we all tell a story a little bit differently. It's all about story and structure, mining the best performances, make it cohesive, make it play in the most interesting way possible in the least amount of time. Because the performances were all so good that some of the difficult parts was actually cutting the picture down because you go, ah, everybody has a different scene that they love. There was about 100 hours of, of film shot. Out of that 100 hours, I ended up with a cut originally that was two hours and 37 minutes long, and the finished cut was an hour and 40 minutes long. I was brought on by Mel Gibson to cut down with him a lesser violent version of The Passion of the Christ so that it could open it up for a wider audience. How do I take 110 on-screen, say, uh, scourging hits out of a movie and still not lose impact and bring it down to, I think we brought it down to less than 20. In the, the comparison for Risen, when we as a company addressed the PG-13 issues, recut scenes not to lose impact just because visually we don't need to see a spear go through somebody to understand that somebody's just been hit by a spear. And it was constantly thinking about how we can show uh, the result and we can imply and we can sell our point without actually getting graphically violent. You know, whether you're religious or you're not, it doesn't matter with this film. It's about, you know, it's just an uplifting story. It, it makes you feel good. It makes you feel hopeful. It's just one of those experiences when you walk out of a theater that you really feel good. You remember the music. You remember the performances. Out of death can come great life, you know. It's about the uplifting nature of human nature, you know. It's a film that, that everybody should see. Hello, Valerie here with a cool movie fact. Josh Hutcherson read the entire Hunger Games trilogy in five days to prepare for his role as Peter. For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. See you.